Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and today's video is about the plus sign on your keyboard versus Control D to make a duplicate. If we want this item, and I've got, I just did a deal, it's called a seamless pattern. I've got my nudge factor set on 10 inches, my box is 10 inches. If I Control D and make a duplicate and then move it over 10 inches, if I hit Control D again, it moves it way over there. It's a little annoying, but I, I do it all the time. I just don't ever think about it. All you have to do is hit the plus sign on your keyboard that's to your right to the, by the numerical keys, and then move it over. Then when you hit plus again, it doesn't move. It just put another copy right on top of that. And then I'm going to hit the plus sign again. It's still there. So you do that. You can hit plus sign and do it again. Let's make it a, a little smaller. Can, um, plus, I get so used to doing control D. So you could actually do this with your hands on the keyboard and just keep hitting plus signs. And let's go ahead and put one of these up top. And I'm going to go ahead and do this seamless pattern. So any one you pick, you can hit the plus sign. So if you haven't seen the seamless pattern video, it's pretty cool. And then we are going to go select it all and go back minus front. And you have this pattern. Then we want to fill it in, so I'm just going to go ahead and finish it. And let's move it over, get rid of our outline. Let's go ahead and bring this into the center of the page with the letter P. Let's, can, let's plus and then hit the arrow key. Plus, hit the arrow key. Now, Control D is nice in this fact because if I was going to go Control D and move it over, all I have to do is hit Control D over again. And it's doing what it's supposed to do. Control D and move it down. And then, of course, you take this pattern and combine it. And you've got a seamless pattern. It's still got lines in there, but they're not visible. And I think, well, I'm a little bit off. <laughs> uh, that shouldn't happen. But I, I must have nudged something out of the way a little bit. So use the plus sign when you need to make another a bunch of copies. And you can always hold, move and hold and then click the right mouse button. And it'll put a copy there. But that's kind of defeating the purpose on this deal because we're nudging it out of the way. So move it out of the way, hit the, the your right mouse button, and it'll, it'll make a copy where you put it. But in this case, the plus sign, and then just hit the plus sign, and then just nudge it over, and you've gone over that 10 inches. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.